So in this video I'm going to show you how to calculate the wind velocity having two heading task ground speed and drift angle. So here we have a true heading of 310 degrees, task of 200 knots, ground speed of 176 knots, and the drift angle of 7 right. So we take our CRP5 to the low speed wind scale. And first we have to put our true heading. So three, one, zero degrees on top. Second, we have to put our TAS. So, you have to adjust the card at 200 knots for this example. After that, we have to put our ground speed. We have to find on the card where our ground speed number is. So, 176. So we got the 176 line, we have, we have to find the drift. So at the line of number 7, as shown here, you have to put a dot. Now we have to rotate the wheel till the dot that we draw hits the center line of the card. So after we make sure that the little dot is aligned to the center line of the card, we read at the true heading 270 for this example. The speed is calculated by counting how many lines we have from the dot that we draw to the dot that is drawn by the manufacturer. So we count 10, 20, 30 and something about 35. So the correct answer is 270 and the speed is about 33 knots. Thanks for watching.